is gonna be like my last. Get in here. Ah! Oh, stop it. Check this out. It's beautiful. The main species in this little lake is walleye, jack, and perch. I'm gonna do my best, and we're really gonna try and get some perch today, other than really ice fishing. Son of a Oh, he's biting. <laughs> Set it good that time. Oh, the nice big perch again. Oh, holy shit. Look at these guys. Oh, that's good coffee. McDonald's, you should sponsor me. I'd be your best client. I am a pretty good client. Client customer, <laughs> that's what I was thinking of. I got a mess going on here. But yeah, this is my little staging area. Let's get up, okay. So, everybody knows perch. They kind of like it on the bottom. And they're kind of piggies. They'll eat a lot of things. So today, I'm gonna change it up a little bit and use some other hooks that I've been looking at for a while. I don't normally use these ones, but we're gonna try them out. Everybody knows when we're fishing trout here, like these are my main hooks right here. You have to use the snap so we'll then uh, go down and tie off on the hook because they're, well, they're, they're smart fish, right? So we're not, well obviously we're not using those today, but we're just gonna use the snap swivel. We're not gonna, um, we're not gonna rig them up like that. I mean, they're not super intelligent. Well, <laughs> perch and jack and all those ones that are out here. They're not as picky of fish, so we don't really have to rig it up as specifically uh, as these guys right here. These are called flutter tails. They're kind of bottom bouncers when you put big jig heads in them. You can kind of bounce them off the bottom and get down really low really quick. So I'm gonna use a couple of these guys and perch like them. And I know perch love these guys too. Like anything kind of fancy pantsy, right? Like this hook, it kind of resembles a uh, little fish is, is supposed to be chasing these two spinners right here. So I know perch really like this one and I've actually, like all my buddies have used this one, but I've never used it. So we're gonna use this one too out there. The crankbaits, you know, little rappels and everything. And they like spinners too. And these little light spinners, I wanna get them down a lot deeper out there. So what I'm going to do is uh, bring some split shots and put those on too. Hopefully we get some perch today. We'll see what happens. Alrighty, let's see if our luck's pretty good today. I hope so. So what I got going today is I hooked this bad boy up. And I put a size smaller, because the other one was a little bit too big, and I put a split shot on it, because these guys usually float around the top, so we're gonna bring it down a little bit, and hopefully get to the level uh, water column that the perch are at. There we go. Oh, what do we got? It's not pulling that hard, I don't think it's a jack. Oh, oh it's getting mad now, I spoke too soon. Come on, girl. Oh, it's a jack. <laughs> the thing is about jack too, they'll eat anything. So, yeah, I'm here. I'm here, girl. Let you dry off there. Yeah, and every hook we're using when we're trying to get perch here, like jack, they'll eat anything. So, chances are, you never know, right? Well, it's a good start. At least we got something. Oh, he hooked right through the mouth, holy cow. Well, he kind of destroyed my hook, but... See you, buddy. The proper way is, you gotta kind of hold them here till they get their bearings back. There we go. Okay, so we've had actually pretty bad luck since that last jack, so I went to the flutter tail here. He's gonna go to the bottom and hopefully get some perch. And if you look at this guy's, well, this is why they call it the flutter tail. That's not why they call it the flutter tail. Come on. Ugh. So this is why they call it the flutter tail. So it moves around quite a bit. So we're gonna bang that on the bottom and hopefully we get a perch. Oh, we had a bite. There we go. Oh, I hope it's a perch. Whoa. Oh, no, 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 that's not a perch. If that's a perch, we got a record. Oh, it's a jack. Oh, oh. It's off, it got off. It's a pretty big, pretty big jack. It's about that long. Not bad. So there's a lot of weeds out here and the fish are jumping a lot so they're staying close to the surface So I'm just gonna throw on a spinner that should probably do the trick I'm hoping and I'm still gonna leave the split shot on so it goes down a little ways This is the one we're gonna roll right now There we go All right the spinner the panther oh. Come on, baby 
Oh, you filthy sluice shark. Come here. Ugh. Well, not what we're looking for. This is really hard to use my knees for this. I gotta pull slack out. Holy man, where is my hook at, fish? Are you kidding me? It is in there deep. Should be able to get it though. I need the things to hold the mouth open, but I don't have that with me. Think about Jack, you know, you almost need leaders, but I'm not exactly trying to target them. Oh, we did a good job. Oh, I had it kind of shook there. You should be okay. I'm surprising I got that without, you can get the little spring loaded tool that holds the mouth open for reasons like this, because Jack swallow these things. But it's a little Jackie, I'll let you go. And like I was saying before, you just gotta hold them to get their kind of bearings back. He's out of here. Oh, <laughs> what do we got? Oh, we're gonna hit the net out. Such a pain. Oh, another jack, third one. I don't know if I recorded the other one yet. You'll find out in the actual video. I think I screwed up. Come here. You guys are destroying me. Oh! But hey, it's sure fun to catch them though. Oh, another one just inhales these hooks. Come on, guys. There we go. Oh! That is so hard to do, and I actually did a really good job. I didn't get him bleeding, so. Oh, maybe we gotta hold them like this. You guys have seen a thousand times. Just let them get their bearings back. He's gone. Well, so far, just Jack, and I really i am trying to get some perch here. And after you get done with the Jack too, especially, you should kind of feel your line. Like I can feel it's a little abrasive now, but we still should be okay. Oh, another one that's next cast. <laughs> oh, that's definitely a uh, Jack. If that was a perch, we'd be uh, in the record books, I think. Come on. Yes, sir. It's probably the same one. Jack will do that, too. You put the same one back, and then the next one bites. They're the same one bites again. No, that one's a little bigger, though. Come on. Oh, my nest too small, almost. Oh, hold still. Oh, shoot. Ah! Okay, that wasn't supposed to happen. If he gets off, it's probably better. Come on. Oh my gosh. Okay, fish. This is enough. First of all, I need to grab you. You don't want to put your fingers in a jack's mouth either. Not a good idea. First, I gotta get the net out of there. Okay, the hook's up. There we go. Fairly nice looking jack, but I'm not interested in them. Oh, well, there he goes. <laughs> I think we're in jack territory here. Might have to go somewhere else, try to get some perch. Because if there's a lot of jack too, you're not going to see many perch. Ah, okay, guys, we're going to go back over there. Hell, we're off fishing, fishing, fishing. Man, we actually pretty good at kayaking because I'm not even getting myself wet. And they say, depending how good you are, is how wet you get. And I'm not even, well, the kayak soaked, but that was from the fish. But I mean, look at us, we're just giving her. <laughs> we had really good luck on the Panther Martin, but it's not the fish we want. So maybe we're just gonna change it up and put another spinner on with a nice looking jig that the perch love. And the good thing about these attachments is you can take your hooks off and put on whatever kind of jig or hook, you whatever you wanna do, and it always has a spinner on it. So it's kind of the presentation that the little fish here is chasing this. It's kind of the idea behind it. Oh, we got a bite. Come on. He's back. Oh, it's tiny. Oh, no, it's not. Ah, what do we got? No, I don't know what we got because we lost it. <laughs> I think he bit a couple times. He must have hit the spinner. The spinner here. And then, yeah. The hook and uh, hook set wasn't wasn't good enough. That's too bad. I don't know what that one was. Oh, we had a bite. There we go. Oh, this is gonna be like my last cast.
Come on. What do we got? These be a walleye. Something to be proud of. Oh, another one. Oh, you guys are crazy. Crazy Jack. Come on. Come on. You're my thumbnail picture. Get in here. Ah! Let's go! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa, buddy. Whoa, buddy. Okay. Stop it. Stop it! This net is not big enough for these fish. Nice, easy, in and out, baby. Okay, we need you for a thumbnail real quick. <laughs> Even though they're jacking, I don't care for them, but they're still fun to catch. They pull pretty good. They like dive bomb too when you get them hooked. Not like trout when they go try to like double backflip like during the Olympics. So, all right, wait. Before you go, I want to know what everybody uses for um, perch lures too. I don't know. Maybe there's some better ones I don't know about. I usually use little spoons too, but I stayed away from those today. I didn't feel like using them. But everybody, let me know what they use in the comments. Very curious, actually. And if you guys like the video, subscribe, helps out a lot. And thank you guys so much for watching and see you in the next video. Thanks.